The race to dominate the electric vehicle EV market is intensifying, with the United States and China emerging as the primary contenders. Both countries recognize the potential of EVs to transform transportation drive economic growth, reduce dependency on fossil fuels, and combat climate change. In this episode, we delve into the current EV race between the US and China, exploring the key players, technological advancements, market dynamics, governmental policies, and the future of this high-stakes competition. Welcome to the electrifying race to dominate the global electric vehicle market. The United States and China are the primary contenders in this high-stakes competition. This isn't just about selling cars. It's a race to secure leadership in a technology that will define the future of mobility, drive economic growth, reduce dependency on fossil fuels, and combat climate change. The U.S. and China have rich histories in the automotive world. In the U.S., the EV journey began with the GM EV1 in the 1990s, gaining momentum with Tesla's groundbreaking innovations in the 2000s. In China, severe air pollution and a strategic focus on reducing oil imports sparked an aggressive push for EV adoption making it the largest EV market today. Companies like Tesla, Lucid Motors, and Rivian are leading the charge in the US. Tesla, under Elon Musk's leadership, has set benchmarks with models like the Model S, Model 3, Model X, and Model Y. Gigafactories in Nevada and Texas ensure large-scale battery production reducing costs and securing supply chains. Lucid Motors luxury EVs, such as the Lucid Air, offer industry-leading range and features, while Rivian's electric trucks and SUVs, supported by Amazon and Ford, cater to adventure and utility vehicle segments. Traditional automakers like GM and Ford are also heavily investing in EVs, with platforms like GM's Ultium Battery and Ford's electric F-150 Lightning and Mustang Mach-E. Meanwhile, in China, companies like BYD, NIO, and Xpeng are driving the revolution. BYD's extensive range includes passenger cars, buses, and trucks, with vertical integration and blade battery technology leading the way in safety and cost-effectiveness. NEO's battery swapping technology and premium vehicles have garnered a loyal customer base, while Xpeng's focus on advanced autonomous driving and AI integration makes EVs accessible and tech-savvy. Governmental policies are pivotal in this race. In the U.S., federal tax credits, state-level incentives, and billions invested in expanding the EV charging network are crucial. Stricter emissions regulations further push automakers toward electrification. Recently, the U.S. government imposed trade tariffs on EVs imported from China to protect domestic manufacturers and encourage local production. In China, substantial subsidies, the Made in China 2025 Air Initiative, and the world's largest network of public chargers drive the market forward. Technological advancements are at the heart of this competition. Both the U.S. and China are investing heavily in solid-state batteries, promising higher energy density, faster charging times, and improved safety. Innovations in battery recycling and second-life applications are essential for sustainability. Autonomous driving technology is another battleground, with companies like Waymo and Tesla in the U.S. and Baidu's Apollo project and Xpeng in China, leading the way. Market dynamics also tell a compelling story. In the US, EV sales surpassed 800,000 units annually in 2023, with Tesla dominating the market. EVs represent over 5% of total vehicle sales, with continued growth projected. In China, over 3 million EVs were sold in 2023, accounting for approximately 15% of all vehicle sales. Affordability and urbanization drive demand, with budget-friendly models like Wuling's Hongguang Mini EV leading the market. Consumer behavior differs between the two markets. 
In the US, larger vehicles like SUVs and trucks are preferred, with brands like Rivian and Ford capitalizing on this trend. In China, affordability and practicality are key, with high levels of urbanization and government restrictions on ICE vehicles driving EV adoption. Both countries face common challenges, such as expanding EV charging networks and securing critical materials like lithium, cobalt, and nickel. Navigating regulatory environments and aligning with international standards are ongoing hurdles. Future directions include potential technological collaboration, emphasizing sustainable practices in manufacturing and battery recycling, and expanding EV adoption in emerging markets and rural areas. The environmental and economic impacts of EVs are profound. They produce zero tailpipe emissions, reducing air pollution and greenhouse gases. The integration of renewable energy sources with EV charging infrastructure enhances these benefits. Economically, the EV industry creates jobs in manufacturing, research, and infrastructure development, offering lower operating costs compared to ICE vehicles. Success stories like Tesla's global dominance and BYD's comprehensive approach highlight the potential of innovation and vision in the EV industry. Looking ahead, technological advancements, market dynamics, and global policies will shape the future of this competition. The race between the US and China will accelerate the global transition to electric vehicles, bringing us closer to a sustainable, electrified future. The race between the U.S. and China to dominate the electric vehicle market is shaping the future of the automotive industry. Both countries are making significant strides, supported by technological innovation, robust governmental policies, and dynamic market players. While challenges remain, the competition is driving progress that promises to revolutionize transportation, reduce environmental impact, and enhance energy security. As the U.S. and China continue to vie for leadership in this crucial sector, the global transition to electric vehicles will accelerate, bringing us closer to a sustainable, electrified future. There you have it. Let's know your thoughts on this episode in the comment section, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching.